Hi, this is Mary from Reviewer's Diary, and yes, I am still having to put my foot up. Um, I don't have a cast any longer, just a quick update. I do have a boot that goes from my foot to my knee, a big boot, um, and my mobility is not great yet, so we have to wait and see how that goes. Um, the doctor says it takes at least six weeks for any bone growth to start to show your scooter. And I don't have any bone growth showing on my x-rays. Scooter, my precious little angel dog, and my big giant um, crazy idiot dog. <laughs> but anyway, um, there are things you don't know about me. Um, I'm an artist, and I painted this. Um, don't know if, you, if I'm close enough. I can't get close enough. <laughs> Oh, to be mobile again. But anyway, I painted this picture. I drew that one over there, but the one I'm most proud of is this drawing over here. Um, which, you know, I mean, I have a whole house full of art, but I can't get everywhere. <laughs> I can show you one that's in my living room. So hold on, I'll be right back. My best work of art was this one. Um, my mother took this photograph in the Muir Woods, Muir, out in California, I think they are. Um, but anyway, I did paint this. Uh, the colors don't come up very well in this camera. Most of you know me as the as a blogger for makeup and beauty. Um, but, you know, like everyone, I have many facets to my personality. So, I did order a one-time only box. Uh, it was on sale for $20 off. It would, normally, when you order one box only of the Let's Make Art watercolor box, it cost $45. This was $25 plus shipping. came to like $32. Plus, I got a free paint set, so I'll show you what that is. Um, they're all acrylics, uh, which are kind of... I'm not sure how I would use them yet, um, but one of them is Pumpkin Patch. And they're pretty big, two ounce si size. Um, this one is Ultra Blue Deep. And I guess so you can work on flesh tones. This is the flesh being I think you can mix this with a little orange and a little blue to make brown. So you can work up uh, or down based on skin tone. Um, so anyway, this is the color blush pink. These right now have limited use for me, but I can see where I could use them. Uh, I did read the instructions on the back. They are regular acrylic paints, but they do clean up with water, soap and water. Um, but then they do become uh, permanent. So, yeah, these would be good in craft projects and even maybe a little touch on a painting that I'm working on. You know, not oil, because I, I do oil paints. Um, so, anyway... I'm not able to go upstairs yet, otherwise I'd show you more of my artwork. So hold on, I'm going to open this box and I'll show you what I got. Okay, so anyway, the inside lid says you're good at this. Oops, let's see if I, I can't back out any further. Oh, there we go. Uh, it comes with a card. I ordered the Let's Make History box. You had a choice of a few different boxes. And, um, yeah, I... They give you um, transfer paper and um, paint. And this says this is the good stuff. Now, I have to say, the reason this box is not worth it is because these are all sample size. <laughs> They're not, look at how small they are. Now, you don't, it's watercolor that's not hard, so it could be that you don't need very much of this. Um, I may watch the video that they made, but it comes, not all boxes come with this much paint. It's because of the box that I chose that, um, it came with this much paint. So, yeah, it's, they're not big. Um, you know, they're by their own brand. 
I don't know. I Whoa! <laughs> Dog just dropped his bone. Sounded like the world was coming to an end. Anyway, under this cardboard, there is um, a postcard and paper that you can paint on. Um, and a sticker. Huh. I might put this on my sketchbook so I know what is the front and the back. That's the major, major reason for that. And inside this package here are different um, artworks and pictures of those artworks. So I'm going to open this up and I'll tell you what's in here. I don't think this box is worth the money that they charge. A normal subscription a normal subscription price is $39 a month and I I just don't think it's worth as much as they're charging especially given that they enclose their own paint and you know their own brand and all you know I just mm. so here's a picture of one of the works of art oh they didn't put the name on the back <laughs> it's in the booklet um, then there is this one And this one, abstract flower. Don't know which. I think this is the side that's up. And my favorite one is the Monet um, water lilies. There's some limitation with watercolors, but I do have gouache um, if necessary. Okay, so um, the um, box comes with instructions for each project. This is Monet Water Lilies, um, O'Keeffe's Abstract Flower, Matisse Shapes. Um, this must have been out of his uh, sketchbook. <laughs> and Van Gogh Starry Night. It also comes with um, sketches for each one of these. <clears throat> and eight pieces of watercolor paper. Very, very heavy, like heavy, heavy duty, like almost like watercolor board. So um, the paper's probably worth quite a bit, I guess, but they're prob they're getting things at a discount. Let me put this back together again. And I'm thinking this is too much price for this box. I think they need to charge a little bit less for this. Um, I'd say $25 might be a fair price, which is what I paid um, somewhere around that. And Oh, and there's also a postcard. Let's make art matter and you paint and send a postcard to somebody. Not sure. And it says the graphite paper is inside. That's the tracing element that you need, but it's one piece and it's folded 50 different ways to Sunday. So I'm not thinking this is worth the money spent. I'm, I am going to probably subscribe to an art box for Mother's Day, but I don't think it's going to be this one because I just don't think the value is there. Uh, and the freebie paints are just the first time you sign up, you get a free set of paints. They don't really count because what you're going to get if you subscribe, you might get a freebie like these, but what you're going to get is something more like this with maybe less paint. I've seen unboxings where there are only three of these paints. So yeah, I am, I'm not, I'm thinking this is just not worth the money spent. So anyway, this is the Let's Make History box and I ordered one box only. It was on sale and to help me decide if this was a subscription I wanted to participate in and sadly it's not. I do have an account now with um, um, this art box and I think you can you know, sign yourself up without having a subscription and I was able to download a whole bunch of different pictures and tracings and stuff so yeah, I just don't think this is worth it. <laughs> so anyway, I know there are some diehard watercolor colorists out there who think this box is great. You know, maybe this is just not the right box for me. 
I just think, you know, I have to think about dollars and cents, and I don't have a whole lot of dollars and cents to spend. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. I think this was originally the February box. Um, I hope you enjoy this, and um, I hope that, you know, it helps you to make a decision if this is right for you or not. Thanks, and if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you aren't subscribed, please do subscribe. Thanks, and have a beautiful evening. Good night.